Senator Lindsey Graham is in Anderson today. He talked to our Lise Devlin about his thoughts on the presidential race and the Supreme Court decision that came down today. Senator Lindsey Graham says the Supreme Court ruling that former President Donald Trump should remain on Colorado's primary ballot is not only a good decision, but he believes the results will be in Trump's favor. In a sweeping decision, the Supreme Court has ruled that states cannot kick former President Donald Trump off the ballot over his actions leading up to the January 6th attack on the Capitol, bringing an end to a case greatly impacting the 2024 election. Senator Lindsey Graham, who endorses the former president, spoke about the ruling. This effort to knock him off the ballot was just really constitutionally very dangerous. I considered it election interference. There's a lot of desire to have something other than a Biden-Trump rematch. I don't think that's going to happen. I think that will be the, the, the choices going into the fall. The court reversed the Colorado Supreme Court, which determined Trump could not serve again as president under Section 3 of the Constitution's 14th Amendment. This decision comes just a day before the Colorado primary and something Senator Graham believes will be a turning point. I think President Trump uh, has a pathway forward not only to the nomination but to the White House itself. Nikki Haley, uh, our former governor here, has run a very good campaign. She's probably done better than any South Carolinian in terms of seeking the presidency. She has a lot to be proud of, but I hope after tomorrow, if the results are overwhelming, which I think they will be, I hope she will, uh, quite frankly, drop out and let us become one team. Senator Graham says he's hopeful Trump will secure a nomination. He is confident in South Carolina's Tim Scott to serve as Trump's running mate. I've had a lot of conversations with President Trump about Tim Scott. Somebody ready to be president on day one. Uh, president Trump wants to make sure his vice presidential nom uh, pick could be president if they had to step into the job. I think there's no doubt that Tim Scott is ready to be president of the United States. And this unanimous ruling by the Supreme Court overturning a decision by Colorado's top court resolves the debate about Trump's ability to run for office nationwide. In Anderson, Elise Devlin, 7 News. Colorado is one of 16 states that has its primary election tomorrow.